Okay, we are on the way to our gender reveal party! <laughs> okay, so I just pulled my camera out because I just got an email with a bunch of different lab results and it has the baby's gender on it. But don't worry, I didn't see it. I thought it was just like genetic testing results to making sure the baby was okay and I'm okay. And so I'm looking through and it's like, oh, low risk for this, low risk for that. And then all of a sudden it just says, yes, reveal the fetal sex. And I was like, what? Thank God. It literally says, do you wish to continue? We were wanting to do a gender reveal in April. It's the beginning of March. Like I can't just sit here with this information on my phone for a month and a half. I guess I need to plan a gender reveal party now, but I can't plan it in April. Like I gotta call Scott. Hey, can we plan a gender reveal party next weekend? I just got the lab results and it tells me what our baby's gender is. I didn't click it, I promise. Okay, either we do a private reveal or we have like a whole gender reveal party. Do you want to have a party? Uh, one week? Uh, I, I don't think we have the self-control not to open it for more than a week. I think we could do it next weekend. Okay, you know what? Tonight I'll delete it off your phone and send a link to someone else that we trust, okay? Okay. It looks like I have a party planned, so I'll talk to you later. Okay. Oh my god, well I guess I'm having a gender reveal party next week. I gotta find someone to help me plan this! Now that I knew I needed to plan a party, it was time to recruit some help. Okay, so I have recruited my friend Kelsey here to help me plan this party because I don't know what I'm doing. So let's plan a gender reveal! We got it. I was on Pinterest and I was figuring out what I want to actually do for the actual reveal. Okay. And I think I want to do like a giant balloon wall. Ooh, that's fun. On top of that, I was thinking we could do some pink and blue cupcakes, kind of like this. And then I was thinking maybe like a little old wives tale sign. Wait, what if we did uh, cotton candy like this? Ooh, some custom cotton candy. Wait, these are the vibes, like pink and blue balloons, lots of balloon arches. Okay. And then what if we did pink and blue lemonade like this? Oh, I love the rubber duckies. <gasps> Cute. Okay, so wait, add okay. all this to the Amazon cart. We need to order it, make sure it's here in a few days. Thank you, Amazon, for rush shipping. Let's get it, boys. Let's head over to see Scott and Yomi and see how the balloon wall's coming. Okay, so right now we are at my office office and Scott and Yomi are here. Hello. And they are working on the balloon dart wall. We're gonna have text up here that says boy or girl, and then we're gonna have different colored checkered squares. With giant balloons. And one of them will be filled with either pink or blue Confetti. powder. And Yomi is gonna be the only one. I'm gonna be the only one that knows, and you guys have done this to me before. When you were pregnant, I was one of the few people that knew, so now you're giving me another secret? Yeah, sorry. I don't like this. But <laughs> the only person she can tell is her mom. <laughs> okay, so this is a, the party is Saturday. Scott, do you think it's gonna be cute? I'm gonna do my best to make it cute. <laughs> I think it'll definitely be cute, yeah. <laughs> well, yeah, I am so excited. Okay, these are the colors that Yoni picked out. <gasps> Ooh, I really like these. Let's see what it looks like. <gasps> oh my gosh, it's oh. literally like a perfect baby blue. Okay, and then let's do pink. My, my bedroom growing up was this color. Stop, really? Like, literally bubblegum pink. Wait, those are perfect. I love that. So the checkerboards between these are gonna look so good. Mm -hmm. Yomi's a queen of picking out paint, apparently. <laughs> we didn't know that, but now we do, and this is perfect for the party. Okay, hello. Me and Kelsey are at Hi, the, the nail, nail salon. salon. So I picked out pink and blue nail polish. Here's my inspo pick. Pop it up. We need to get rid of these ugly nails. And have something cute for baby Ellis. <laughs> so, can we just talk about how crazy pregnancy nails are because these are my real nails. I have never had long nails in my life and they had grow so fast. Okay, our nails are done. Look how cute. Okay, and then this hand, blue. So cute. Ready for baby Ellis, boy or girl? I'm so excited. With just a few days until the party, it was time to buy some last minute decor. Okay, so we are currently at Party City to buy stuff for the gender reveal. Look how cute is all these things. Oh my god, wait, Kels, I should have just put these on. I literally paid for my nails to be done. Oh my, and those were $8. Wait, look at these fun glasses. Oh my god, we have to get all of it. A little bit of everything. Wait, why is everybody having a boy? Look, there's no blue powder. There's only pink powder. Apparently everyone's having boys. <laughs> these are cute. Hey. We what? To make this anymore. We were gonna make it on Canva? We could just buy this. Oh, slay. It's old wives tales. Perfect. I like this. We can hang this on the oh, door. Oh, yeah, we can hang it on the door. That's... We're so creative. Everybody's so creative. <laughs> it's just so fun and exciting. I love planning parties. <laughs> oh, wait, the butter mints. No one eats the butter mints. Keely. What? I like butter mints. I think we should go for the chocolate cigars. <laughs> oh my gosh, our cart is getting so full. We have to get out of here, Kelsey. We've got to go. We're about to spend so much money. No one tells Scott. 
I hope my baby appreciates this. If you're watching this in the future, baby, I know that your mom loves you and spends a lot of money on you. With one day left until the party, it was time to start setting up all the decor. Okay, here we go. I'm making the pretzels. Anyway, I'm making the pretzels. Look at this blue. It is so satisfying. Oh my gosh. So I don't know the best method. Should I dunk? The air chair. Should I swirl? I feel like you need a vase. Oh, a vase would have been Ooh, it. Ooh, I'll go get a vase. This was the insult pick I saw on Pinterest. Boom. Yay. This is so much of a better method. Oh my God. Da 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 in the reveal. These are my first two mess ups. So if anybody wants a pretzel, I have two extra. And then these are the pink ones. They're so cute. It is time to do the cupcakes. And I was gonna bake them myself. However, I get nauseous at the sight of anything. So Kelsey bought pre-made cupcakes and I'm gonna decorate them. We're just gonna cover up the ugly sprinkles with the pretty ones. This one has none. We're fixing it. Leave me alone. Oh my God, these are gonna be so cute. My job, the pretzels and cupcakes, done. Mallory left already, but she did such a good job on this. It's actually finally sitting in that like tomorrow I'm gonna know the gender. That is actually nuts. Like, isn't that kind of weird? You know, the reveal balloons are just don't pop. Like, I know. Peak, like, I gotta show you guys this. These are all of the balloons. So like, what if I looked? <laughs> no, because we would have to pop the balloon. They're all black balloons. One of them has the color. Yomi knows, you could hound her tomorrow. I'm so nervous. Okay, I'm gonna I'm gonna go ahead and open this before I get sweaty because it is kinda hot in here. I'm team girl. I'm going with Keely on this one. I want it to be a girl. Let's see. <laughs> I can't say anything. I can't say anything! Oh my gosh, I cannot believe today is the day. Oh my God, my eye just started twitching. Probably stress. <laughs> We're on the way to the gender reveal party and I am so anxious and nervous and excited. I was up till 4 a.m. with like shaky anxiety and then also just woke up this morning feeling so stressed and anxious. And it's not like I'm actually stressed. It's just I'm like so excited and so nervous and so scared and all of the things. Yeah. So my outfit today, I'm wearing a blue dress, a little pink top and I'm wearing these cute little boy girl earrings. How are you feeling, Scott? I'm just so ready to know, yeah. I think it's gonna really set in to be real, let's you know. Yeah, I think so. Yeah, so Hello! Hey. We are at the party, it is in full swing. Yes, and we're looking for little hidden babies because there's a prize if you find them. Yeah, I so know. that's my sole mission right now. She's three. three. Okay, so I got here and it was absolute chaos, so I had to just like, set up all of the balloons and like just rush get ready. So we're here and now everything's done. Look at it. It looks amazing. Look, let's take a look around. We got all the food and snackies. <laughs> look at the cupcakes, blue and pink lemonade. We got all the candy. This looks amazing over here. People are already starting to guess if it's a boy or girl. Okay, here is Scott's fit, wrapping blue and pink. Here's my full fit. Yay. They got cute. I love the earrings. What do you think? Good. Van Paul, I just have to say your outfit is incredible. Your outfit is so good. I love it. Are you guys team boy or team girl? I am team boy. Team boy, 100%. Yeah, team boy. I think it's a girl. I've been on team girl for a long time. I'm team boy. Uh, I'm team boy, yeah. I think it's team girl because as sick as Keely has been. But we're going to be thrilled no matter what. I didn't say anybody who was team girl and pushing them in the pool. I'm glad I'm not team girl. And I weirdly think there's two of you for some reason. I'm confident as a boy. Keely is a vessel for a boy. Team boy. I'm team boy as well. Team. I'm team boy for sure. Team girl, all day. Because we have three right. girls, and if they have a boy, it's yeah. not fair. What Keely happens boy. if we had a kid and it was a girl? I don't know. Kind of like said, in the wild, that guy probably gets like two or something like that. Hey, editors, please cut this out. I think it's going to be a girl. I think her symptoms say girl, but I feel in my soul it's going to be a boy. Well, my want is I want a boy right mm. now. I want a boy too, but at the same time, I feel like it's a girl, so I also want a girl. Are y'all looking for the babies? <laughs> y'all are all intensely looking for them. So you're having like, you're giving birth today? What? He just asked if I'm giving birth today. Huh? Josh just oh. asked if I'm giving birth today. Oh. Leah, are you looking for the babies? Yeah, I have five. You have five? Oh, boy, she did say that they're in here. They're throughout the whole house, I think. I found another baby. <gasps> you found one! I found a baby. <laughs> I built all of those by hand no, myself. No, no, <laughs> I did that. <laughs> the same I don't know about this. I dipped all of these 
pretzels by myself. I can attest she did it herself. <laughs> what size do you guys think the baby is currently? Lemon? A large blackberry. Maybe She's a raspberry. A papaya. Papaya? Yeah. <laughs> I'm gonna say it's like the size of a orange or something. Maybe like a small melon. Like a cantaloupe. I think an orange. Answer that. Oh! Ugh, you were much closer. What I've seen I... lemons this big. Actually, that's kind of crazy. That is kind of crazy. That's kind of cool. Cantaloupe. It is an orange. Like really? A, like yeah. a melon. I was right! Does this mean it's a girl then? Because it's so small? This. Oh, it's an yes. orange. It's, way, yeah, an it's orange. much bigger than a... This is the size of a papaya. <laughs> Compare it to a papaya, please. <laughs> Whoa. That is it's, crazy. It's a little small, dude, boy. It has like... Are some jeans that should be a lot bigger. Okay. Right? Holy cow. Can you leave that just in there like this? Oh my gosh. I, lo I love this little orange. Try to look at Hi, Mom. How do you feel? I feel fabulous. We're about to find out what we're having. <laughs> you obviously think it's a girl. I, and I really don't care. Your boy or girl, you're gonna be so loved. Embarrassed, it doesn't matter. But I do think maybe a girl because of all the sickness. That's true. Then what are you doing? I need to make sure that it's a boy. I'm making sure that we have a nice balance. Here, There's okay? Preston. <laughs> Preston. Preston. How many times did you put your name on here? Like seven times. I can do it again. Stop. Not using enough. all the stickers. There's plenty of stickers to go around. I'm trying to increase the chances here. Oh my god, I don't think that's how this works, bro. No, it does, trust me. There's strength in numbers. Okay, so I haven't actually seen the balloon dart wall completely finished, but here it is! Ah! I'm so excited, oh my gosh. It's like so good. Oh my gosh, Scott and Yoni killed it. <sighs> I'm nervous. I like don't want to be around this because I'm like, what if the balloon pops in front of me? I can't do this. Right now, Yomi's doing family interviews with all the family members to ask them what they think it is, and then we're gonna do the real. Literally in like 20 minutes, I'm gonna know. That's crazy. Ah! Look at side. Before they mess it. Like, why don't you just have your own son? If you want one so bad. It's not the same. And if it's a girl, everybody who voted for a girl is getting pushed in the pool. Oh. Including you. I have a camera! Your reaction was the camera and not the child. <laughs> The baby would be fine, the camera would not be. <laughs> what would you guys want to wish for Scott and Keely as they become first time parents? I'm just so excited for you guys. I'm so excited to see you step into this new season of life as a mom and a dad. You guys are gonna be amazing parents. Ditto. Because <laughs> <laughs> I've never been a parent before, I don't have a lot of advice. I'm just very excited to be an uncle. And I'm very excited to have another nephew or niece. My advice would be, that y'all are already beautiful souls and you are really good at influencing others to be a light and teach them positivity and be a mentor. So don't lose that. Keep that up as y'all become parents to like take that and bring it to the next generation. Scott will probably be the best dad. Keely, you'll be a good mom. Thank you guys so much. <laughs> a lot of people don't know this, but if you use the detergent pods, you're missing out on half of your wash cycle. Uh, Actually, the first cycle that requires a little bit of deterrent. What? I think this is supposed to be advice on parenting. Oh, I got nothing then. The simplicity that I give is continuously trust in God. That's good advice. Stay in your baby's world. Don't get so in a rush as parents with your own agenda that you forget how important to get into their world and where they are. Sit with them and be interested in what they're interested in at every single step of the way so that you, you're creating agency. Don't forget that's really important no matter how busy you get. Get into the world. It's almost time. Are you ready? <laughs> I'm so ready. The nerves are starting to kick in a little bit. I'm like so anxious and nervous. I feel <coughs> I might throw up. Sorry. <laughs> you hey, I'm really excited. <laughs> okay, babe, are you ready to go find out? Let's go. Let's go do it. <laughs> Thank you guys all so much for coming. Me and Scott are so appreciative that you're here to celebrate. Um, we're so excited. Either way, boy or girl, we just know that this baby's going to be so loved because of all the people that have come together to just celebrate with us. So thank y'all for being here. <laughs> with everybody's totals, it was 63 for boy and 78 for girl. Yeah! <laughs> are y'all excited? Yeah! All right, let's go outside. Three, two, one. I'm gonna help you guys out a little bit. Three, two, one. Oh. I'm so scared!
god! Oh. Go big guy. Oh. Oh. So dark. Oh. I'm gonna help you guys out a little bit more. Ah! Oh, it's white! It's flower! Oh! Oh! oh. I feel like I need to run laps. Dressing me out. Oh okay, 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 let him know about it. Come on, Chris. You got it, Chris, come on. For you, Scott. Oh. This little oh, baby's stubborn. Oh. Guys, I need to know, come on. Three, two, one. Next one. She really wanted to go. Oh. It's okay, boy. You're going to be the best boy dad ever. Team boy! <laughs> that was so much adrenaline. I feel like I, I need to run a mile. <laughs> What'd I say, huh? I love you. <laughs> yes, I love you so much more. Shut up. Goober, <laughs> you don't have to push anybody in the pool now. Oh, no, I do. I said all the people who voted for girls to be getting in the pool. What's his name, Roger? Mm, Preston. No I'm kidding. <laughs> I was wrong. Yeah, you were. I don't care. Oh. I'll get it. I'll get it right next time. Right. Yeah, you will. Uh, so it was a boy. Um, blue was the color of the confetti. 